Alrighty, here we have Maggie Magnet being played on the Switch, courtesy of Asia Soft. Interestingly enough, when you start the game, it immediately kills you, gets you into options. It doesn't actually get you into the main menu, which I thought was going to be interesting. So you're at settings, language, um, and I guess maybe text. No, I'm sorry. Uh, language, audio, special, progress. Uh, that's it. They have controls there. You have start and to start the game. So you have gears and secrets you can collect uh, for each area. You have several different areas you can you can play in. There's quite a bit here actually. <laughs> there's there's what 15. Uh, there's 15, and each area has 10 levels in it. So good, good. Uh, Good chunk of stuff there. So, um, the only buttons you have, well, the button you have is the A button, which is the attract button. I'm assuming is what it is. And the point of the game is to get May Magnet to collect all of the, all the collectible gears. And then make it the goal. Now you do have a button, you do have a couple of buttons, you can, there's a button for, um, for skipping the level, uh, which is going to be the, uh, L button, and then you can go back a level by hitting the, or sorry, the L buttons to go back a level, the R buttons to go ahead a level. Okay, I didn't notice that before, that's cool, so, if you go back through the level, it'll show you. Uh, which gear you have uh, you've missed. So that's, that's kind of neat. I like that. And then you have the Y button to swap through the color palettes, which is kind of cool. And then you have the um, X button to reset the level. So those are all the buttons in the game. And as you can see, you can swap the color palettes on the fly. And the uh, gameplay, I mean, the, the, the only real challenge in the game, really realistically, is how kind of off the controls feel. <laughs> the controls just feel um, kind of crazy, honestly. It's not, it's, the control's not all that great. And I think that's part of what makes the game fun, I guess. I mean, as weird as that is to say. Um, it just, it's part of the challenge, really. There we go. Uh, but some of the levels are kind of uh, annoying with the way that Peggy controls. And that stupid magnet ball. Like before, when I first started playing the game, um, that puzzle right there was not fun at all to play. And this one, as well, was kind of difficult. Because of the fact that, there we go, because of the fact that you, she always wanted to go to the little ball of magnets and not want to go up through, <laughs> through the goal. But the more the, the the more you play, the more you grow accustomed to how uh, to how the game controls and what to expect. So it definitely helps to to keep playing the game, even if the controls do seem a little challenging at first. Dead. 
definitely worth worth checking out for sure. Um, I've had a lot of fun with this game so far. Um, I haven't beat it. I've gotten most of the way through it. Um, but it's definitely, definitely a fun little game. Fun little puzzle game. And one I would definitely recommend. If you're a fan of puzzle games, uh, this game's definitely worth it, you guys. It's fun. It's fun. It's challenging. Especially when you've got puzzles like this. Come on. Well, Maggie, I'm just have her roll all the way over there. As slow as she's rolling, she should make it to the gear. And I can continue. I mean, I could just always skip the level or, or reset it, but... There we go. Well, I may have to at this rate. But yeah, so you're kind of at the mercy of that stupid spinning magnet there at the top. There we go. That's going to do it. There we go. Okay. So the controls are half the challenge in this game. And some puzzles are going to be easier than others. But like I said, overall a really fun puzzle game. If you like puzzle games, it's definitely one to check out. And then I'm going to end here, guys. This has been a look at Maggie Magnet on Nintendo Switch, courtesy of uh, East Asia Soft. And again, definitely a game I would recommend playing. Uh, if you like puzzle games, this is a game that is definitely worth it. And uh, well, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And as always, until next time, take care and happy gaming.